Good day, Team GCI. I'm Brad, and in today's GCI Market Outlook, let's take a look at Forex trading on Pound Kiwi, Euro Dollar, and the Dow Jones Industrial Average. The risk-off attitude is continuing with the U.S. indices, even though we saw a spike from the non-farm payrolls. Before we look at that, don't forget to like, subscribe, and get notified on YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram. Yes, the U.S. non-farm payrolls were lower than expected, giving stocks a boost, but the sell-off continued. We look to go short on some of the indices, but wait for confirmation. For example, on the Dow Jones Industrial Average, we see price action heading for the upper trend line, and MACD is looking bearish. However, we may want to wait for a bounce and possibly an overbought stochastic oscillator. As well, you can see how the non-farm payrolls gave us an opportunity to trade with the trend by sending price action temporarily against the trend. In the news this week, we have US CPI and PPI, which may sway the Fed in their next interest rate decision. We have employment and GDP figures out of the UK, and a European interest rate decision where we expect lower rates, so watch for volatility. We see mixed strength and weakness in the euro pairs, so a counter-trend move might give us some good opportunities. We are mixed with GBP pairs as well, so watch for counter-trend price action just after the news. For example, if we see price action moving up in a bear run on GBP New Zealand dollar, if price goes higher, it may reverse to the downside later. That's all for now. CFDs and FX are leveraged products and your capital may be at risk.